Hey y'all, it's T and welcome back to Tea Time. In this video, we'll be going out to CVS to figure out what we are going to do for this week's of deals. Um, newbies, remember when you scan your card at the red box that looks like this, make sure you scan and receive the message saying that no more coupons can be printed. This will ensure that you have the majority of your um, CRTs printed. CVS I need a drink but I don't drink so this is what I came and did instead to get my mind clear because I was so 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 aggravated after all of that at CVS but anyway I have another pegboard up on this side um, remember in my stockpile video I had two totes right here that were full of like um, plugins and um, warmers and all kind of different things so I've emptied both of those out and this is what I have um, done with it I have another pegboard on this side took my time and put it up when I came home came back home my husband already had it hung so all I had to do is put my little um, pegs on it and hang my stuff so this is what I did and shout out to those who suggested that I get another one to put these items on. So it has freed up some space for me to put some other stuff. And this is still my overflow basket and all of that. And this is the other side, the other one that I have on the other side. Oh, and I got my blinds up. So over here should be a lot cooler and it's gonna block all of the sun out from um, hitting my products. and to keep nosy people from looking into. <laughs> so yeah, it's the little things y'all that just makes couponers happy. Just seeing stuff in order, neat, all of that good stuff, and to get your mind off of stuff, which is what this did. All right, let me go shoot the CVS video. All right, y'all, this is my CVS haul. I have never ever had so much trouble at CVS in all my years of couponing. Like, I felt like I was at Walgreens today. I really did. And I almost just walked up out of there and left all of this stuff in CVS. Um, as you saw from the clips, I shut the system down six times. Six times <laughs> I shut the system down. And it even didn't get to the point of printing. You know, my transaction wasn't even completed. This was in the process of scanning coupons and all of this other stuff. It just shut down. Everything just blacked out. Like, I don't know what's going on. I'm thinking that I may try... Um, a different store because it's only happening at this one store last week i couponed at a different store and then the week before that i was at another store i didn't have any issues but it's just no i take that back this is the same store where i had the 8 by 10 receipt printout 
that I froze up the the uh, system again. So I don't know. And this is like my favorite store. I love the people. They know me. Everything is smooth. And I hate to switch stores, but I may have to. But um, shout out to Heather, my cashier. If you are watching, um, she probably was the one to like kept me in the store because like I said I was ready to go home I was ready to just walk away and she was like no I know you when you come up in here you always have your stuff together and I'm not understanding why things are not working out for you and we're going to work and work and work until we get it figured out so that's what she did so like always let me break down each individual deal and then tell you what I did in the transactions. This was supposed to be all one transaction, but it ended up being three. All right, so my first deal was the spend 30, get 10. Um, I picked up two of the Downy Unstoppables. These were 494. I had a dollar 50 off of one CRT, and I also used two $1 off of one coupons from the September PNG. Keep in mind, those coupons are a limit of one, but if your store allows you to use more than one, you can do so. But if they do not, split your transactions up. All right, and then for the Tide Pods, these are $4.94 as well. I had two $2 off of one coupons from the September P&G. Also had a $3 off of 10 Tide Pods um, CRT. Now keep in mind, both of these together is $9.88. Now you can only use it on two if your store participates in the 98% rule. So 90% of um, $10 would, well 98% of $10 would be $9.80. So this comes up to $9.88. So we just made it <laughs> with enough to use that three off of 10 um, Tide Pod CRT. And I actually got three of those today, but today I only use one. All right, and then I picked up this big old package of Scott paper towels. This was um, $3, no, I wish it was $3. This was $10.49, and I had a $2 off of 10 Scott or Kleenex CRT. So I used that on this and that took um, $2 off. So the total for this spend 30 get um, 10 deal was $30.25. After all of the coupons, it um, brought everything down to $17.75. I got back the $10 ECB. So it made each item $1.55 which was crazy. I haven't bought um, paper towels from CVS since Corona came to town. So it's been a good hot minute since I bought paper products from CVS. So yeah, that was an awesome, awesome deal on that. Moving on to the Cedar Field. These were $5.49, no $5.79. Two of them total $11.58. No promotion or anything on it. I had a $5 off of two CRT and then I had a $4 off of one CRT. Brought it all the way down to $2.58. Then I submitted my receipt to Ibotta and then got back a dollar and fifty cents for each one, so a total of three dollars back, making these free plus a forty-two cent money maker. And these track toward beauty. And if you have not smelled these before, they smell so good. 
um, the You Buy Kotex deal. These liners are $1.79, buy one, get one half off. So $1.79 and then the second one rings up for $0.90. Cents. Total comes to $2.69. I had a $2 off of any pad, liner, or tampon CRT. So I paid 69 cents, got back $2. So these were free plus a dollar and 31 cent money maker. All right, so that is everything that I bought in this first transaction. And here is my receipt. You can see the Scott at the top, the Donnie Unstoppables, the two Tide Pods, the two Kotex, and the Cedar Fill. Here are all of my coupons. Um, the two two dollar at the top is for the pods. The two one dollar is for the unstoppables. You can see my CRTs for the Cedar Fill, the Tide Pods, the Scott. Um, the two dollar off of two for the feminine um, care. Dollar off of five. Dollar fifty off of five. Sorry for the downy. And then I used. $21 in ECBs, but then I got back $10 for the spend 30 get 10 deal, $2 for the um, Kotex, and then I also got back the um, $3 from Ibotta. Okay. So it was like I paid um, $6 for all of these items here, which was not bad at all. All right, moving on to what I did in the uh, second transaction, which was the um, beauty deal and then the oral care deal. All right, so the beauty deal, I have the Herbal Essence Shampoo and Conditioner. These were two for 12. I had a $3 off of two manufacturer coupon from the August, no, excuse me, September PNG. Also had the $3 off of two digital coupon that also came off. Um, the Pantene, these are two, no, three for 12. Um, I had a $3 off of three manufacturer coupon from the September PNG. Also had a $3 off of three digital coupon that also came off for that. And then the Revlon, these are $5.49. I had a $5 CRT from the last week that everybody got that I used on this. All right, so the total for all of these items came up to $29 and 49 cents i know i am over but i did not have coupons for the l'oreal items so i had to use what i had it still worked out to be a good deal in my opinion so 29.49 after all of my coupons i was left to pay 12 dollars and 49 cents i got back the 10 dollar um epic um gift card and then I was only $19 away from my next beauty club reward. So this will actually count toward that. And then I will get back a $3 beauty book in 48 hours. So it made the, this deal free plus a 51 cent money maker. All right, so moving on to the oral care deal. These were the Crest toothpaste were $2.99. Buy three, get back a $5 ECB. The toothbrushes were 5 dollars 
buy one, get back a $3 ECB limit of two. All right, so what I ended up doing, the total for both of these came up to $19.95. I had a three off of 18 oral care CRT. I had a $6 off of four digital coupon. And then I thought that my $2 coupon was gonna come off for these, but it did not. Instead, um, that six off of four must have attached to these. And then that $1 coupon came off for the toothpaste. So, I was left to pay $9.35, but then I got back $6 for the toothbrushes and then $5 for the toothpaste, totaling $11, making um, this free plus like $1.65. Yeah, $1.65 money maker for this deal. So let me show you what the receipt looks like for this transaction. You see my Pantene, the Herbal Essence, the Crest, the Oral B, the Revlon, and I threw in a bag of Cheetos so my um, ECB wouldn't get adjusted down so much. And you can see my coupons at the top. The two $3 coupons are the manufacturer coupons for the shampoo. You can see my um, digital coupons came off for the Herbal Essence and the Pantene, the Crest, um, one dollar coupon and then that six off of four came off at five dollar for the Revlon um what is this the kiss bombs and then three off of 18 oral care and then my care pass and all that came off which totaled up to twenty two dollars and ninety four cents is what I use in ECBs on this transaction but I got back the ten dollars here the $6 here for the oral care items, and then the $5 for the um, toothbrush. So I got back um, $21. Yes, I got back $21. But then I will get back the $3 in a couple days, so I actually got back $24. So this transaction was free plus a $1 six cent money maker. But okay, last transaction. I had to go to another store because my main store was wiped of these and they were wiped of the poise pads. So I went to another store that was on my way home and picked this up. The Depends are $5.99. There is a $3 digital coupon as well as a dollar off of one app only coupon. So when you buy one of these, you will get back a $2 ECB. So those coupons will actually take off $4. So you'll be left to pay $1.99, get back the $2 ECB, making it free. So here's that receipt. And I actually used a Fetch gift card for this because I didn't have a $2 ECB to use and I didn't want to use a $3 one and it get adjusted down. So um, I use a Fetch gift card. And you can see I got back the $2 ECB. All right, so the final breakdown for all 21 items. So I started out with, I used $43.94 in ECBs. I got, I'm left with $35 in ECBs. I got back $3 from my bottom. And then in two days, I will get back $3 in beauty bucks. All right, so that totals $41. Spent $43.94, got back $41. So all of this came up to $2.94 for all 21 items. Or if you wanna break it down further, 14 cents each. I think that that was amazing considering what I went through to get this stuff, okay? And I'm happy that I'm getting some paper towels because I don't like how low I'm getting on paper towels. So it's time for me to start stocking up. So yeah, that's everything that I did at CVS. Hopefully we won't have these kind of problems anytime soon. Um, next week I am going to try to go to another store. I don't want to but that may be the best thing. And I'm actually gonna to talk to the um, the store manager. He had already left by the time I got up there to check out. Um, 
I have to see what's going on with their system because it's only that store. All right, it's only that store. And my transactions are not that big. This is not big considering to what some people do. So I shouldn't be shutting down registers no six times for this little bit of stuff. But anyway, y'all, if you have any questions about anything that you have seen in this video, please post them below. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram. All right, y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching. Oh,